Thank you. Yo, what's up? This is Max. I'm from Yumi at Six and I play guitar. I'm here to talk to you about uh, my tattoos. Uh, so I start off with the latest one I got was, I got a boomerang tattooed in Australia, Melbourne. Well, Melbourne, Australia, if you want to call it that. Um, I got it done just for the reason of that I didn't think our band would ever get to be playing shows across the world. And I think Australia is my favorite place I've ever been to as a person. Like, that's my favorite place to go. So I decided to get a boomerang tattoo just so people go, why have you got a boomerang tattoo on you? And I'd be like, well, I've played shows in Australia and we've been over there and headline shows over there. And I didn't think we'd ever get to do that. So I was pretty stoked. So that's a memory for the, the first headline tour we did in Australia. Uh, that was the one before, it says same blood and I got that tattooed with uh, four guys on Warp Tour this summer just to kind of memor like have memories and stuff like that these are my friends who I spent a lot of time with on the road and for two months and Warp Tour is like a pretty gruelling tour and you kind of meet a lot of different people on the tour because this year is over about a thousand people and these people like the people are spending most of my days with hanging out, enjoying myself, relaxing. They'll come and watch us every day as well and I'll be like, yeah, sweet, these are like my true friends. So we all decide to go and get tattooed on uh, one of the days off in Vegas because my friend knew one of the tattoos called Chris Garcia in a cult tattoo, I think it is. In a, it's inside the Planet Hollywood casino. So I got that done. Uh, this, this one here, the grandfather clock, it's simply just a band tattoo, just it's at the time of six, just to represent you, me at six. Just I wanted something just to be like, yeah, my band, like I've done something with my band. It's not like you look at it and you go, oh, that's just a grandfather clock. They wouldn't just look at the time straight away and go, oh, it's a six o'clock. That means this band is like, people have to ask about it. Why did I get a grandfather clock done? It's kind of like, I play in a band. It's just, like, it's just something I can look on when I'm like older later in life and there's people like, oh, you're going to regret getting tattoos. You're going to regret ta getting tattoos. And I'm going to be like, I don't regret getting anything done because they've all got like a memory behind it as well. The the wolf, I got that done on the first year we did Warp Tour by a, I'll call him the wolf man himself who's Frank Carter from Gallows. And it was like my first big piece and I was saying to Frank, I was like, look, I really want to get a wolf done. And he was like, yo, I've got a perfect idea. We'll just do a, uh, we'll do a Sailor Jerry's piece on you. And I was like, sweet. So we went there and got tattooed by the wolf man himself. So pretty cool. I've also got a one-up mushroom, I'm not gonna lie. I'm a massive Mario fan, like I'm a geek, like big time. And Mario's the first computer game I played and I still play computer games to this day. And it's kind of like a family tattoo as well because I still play Mario with my dad these days at home playing like Super Mario Kart and it's like something I can have like when I go home and just be like, yeah, let's have some fun with my dad because I don't really get to see him that much anymore. So this one here, the heart locket, padlock is a uh, it's a friendship tattoo. I've got like a friend at home who's been my best friend for like three, four years now. And he was touring with our band doing our merch at one point and then he went off and did his own thing. He started doing merch with other bands and stuff. And he's like, he's my best friend, I would say, like outside of this band. And it's like, you know, when you're away from you, like some of your best friends, you keep you like intact and keep you like, look, you gotta keep going forward. You gotta keep striving to do something. Like, don't let yourself down. Don't be brought down. Like, he's that kind of person to me. So, if I'm ever like, in a place, I can, I can give him a call. I'd be like, oh, he's there. He's, he's there with me, pretty much. Um, another one I got is, I got, it's a, it's a gramophone. Like, and it says the words of music we trust because all I've wanted to do in my life is music and that's all I believe in and all I really want to do so I pretty much wanted to have something that represents music is my life so I got that done and then on my back I've got the uh, I've got the Illuminati the third eye just because I'm a bit curious about the Illuminati I'm just like you know people always kind of a bit suspicious about it and it's like it's quite an interesting thing to talk about and like I don't know what to think about it myself personally just because you don't know what to believe these days, but I'm intrigued to hear any story about the Illuminati. And they are my tattoos, apart from what I've got. It says the word faith. You just gotta have faith to do stuff. I wouldn't be in a band if I didn't have faith, so.